anti Disney. I really am. I'm anti Disney. Why are you anti Disney? Because I'm anti Disney because I think it, it perpetuates this notion that like love is this magical perfect right. moment of a prince and a princess and this it's bullshit yeah. and it feeds into kids at a yeah. very young age that like that's what's supposed to happen and for how progressive culture is like we're such a progressive culture that we're genderless now we're sexless we're but yet for some reason we still perpetuate Disney stereotypes that were created by these old fucking white dudes who were like, you have to be the man's dream slave. Yeah, you know, yeah, like, yeah. So how come that's still... I don't understand. Dude, it's, not he- it's not a healthy idea. Yeah. Honestly, when I went to Disney, when I took my daughter to Disney two years ago with me and my mom and my daughter, I said, nobody else is coming. I didn't bring Jazz in. I didn't bring anybody else. I said, I'm shutting everybody else out of this. It's just about me, my mom, my kid. Well, no, I, we, we weren't together at the time. Me and Jazz and I, you know, I should have, in retrospect, I should have just brought my whole family, but whatever. I spent $50,000 to take my kid to Disney. But <laughs> I, when I went there, when I went there, even my mom said this, and she's like a huge Disney fan. It's a little like, you know, you have Mickey Mouse, you have everyone running around, and they're, they're like patting themselves on the back, how good they are, how good Disney is, because they're giving back to the children. At that time, they had, we said we only use paper straws to save the sea turtles and blah, 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 blah. All the food fried chicken, cheeseburgers, yeah. french fries, yeah. no healthy options at all, disgusting. Meal plans were hundreds of dollars to take my daughter to get her hair done at the Bippity Boppity Boot Boutique fucking hair Cinderella thing, $800. Oh my god. But yet god. they're patting themselves on the back like we use paper straws. It was a little bit like satanic yeah. and it's a little bit like you are the biggest pieces of shit because most people are waiting in line very stressed out very angry it's disney is a stressful stressful thing but disney's sitting there making all this money being like we're disney we're the nice people i think disney is corrupt it's their pieces of shit and they own half the porn do you know that they, they own through yeah. subsidiary companies most of the porn hub and you porn google that disney owns porn yeah well, i'm supportive of that they I got to be honest with you. That's the one thing I think I'm real. Now you flip yeah. my lid on that. Disney, I think that's cool. That's cool, right? That Actually, is cool. Yeah. No, but it is the thing. Like, I don't have, I, I like, look. Disney executives pleased to announce acquisition of Pornhub. Yeah, well, Go back why, to that article. Look well, at why that. not? Why yeah. not? They're in the bit. They're in the digital business. You might as well own the, it's like, you. here's my thing. It's like when you see a car dealership that doesn't just sell Acuras, they sell Hondas, and they say, it's like, yeah, dude, you, if you're going to do it, you might as well go all the way in. My beef with Disney is I just don't like I think it's sweet when little kids get these fantasy worlds, but I think this whole, like, I th- what we were talking about is where my beef is from, is, like, this fantasy that, like, you're going to meet a perfect person, and, and I think it, it gives this really false hope for people yeah. in to find love, and I think it really does, as we get older, cause a detriment to healthy love standards. I really genuinely believe that. I think yeah. when we were kids, you saw these things that made you feel like that's what life was supposed to be like, and then yeah. you get older, and then not until you're 40 and twice divorced with two mortgages and you're smoking weed on a jet ski yes. in Fort Lauderdale do you realize... Holy shit, this yeah. is fucking fake. That's why all of a sudden, you know, you know, my girl's all of a sudden running her mouth. She wants to get married. I said, stop watching Disney. Cut it out. All right. Stop like, watching Disney. The idea, the idea that Disney made of <laughs> marriage is bullshit. It's bullshit. It is. Marriage should be at a courthouse. It should be formal. There shouldn't be, it should not be a rite of passage. No. We shouldn't celebrate. It uh-uh. should be an exchange. You should handshake. Yes. I'll see you at the house. Going, That's it. Getting married should be like going to the DMV. You're doing it. You're waiting in line. You take a number and then you get the shit over with and then we see what happens. We'll and see should, what happens. It should be some angry city employee that doesn't give a fuck. They make you come back 10 times because you don't have the right paperwork. This whole you thing. You don't have form 684, sir. You don't have it. Yeah. All right. That's All what right. it should be. That should be marriage. That's what marriage should be. But everybody, like you said, wants to get married in a castle because of Disney. Because of the Disney princesses. Disney ruined Disney ruined real love. I think it gives a fake idea what love is. What First was of that? all, you're putting out a lot of sex right now, Santino. Me? I mean, look at his thigh. You look like, yeah, you look like a jeans commercial. Guess but who an old doesn't? jeans commercial like Jordash. 